Now at 5, campaign 2014. Senator Joe Donnelly makes a stop in Fort Wayne to stump for an Indiana State House race. Good evening, Donnelly and Democrat Thad Gerardo met with voters in downtown Fort Wayne. Gerardo is running for the 81st District State Rep seat against the incumbent Republican Martin Carbaugh. News Channel 15's Alyssa Ivinson met up with the senator and the candidates today, and she has the story tonight from Studio 15. Well, senator Donnelly endorsed Gerardo earlier this month, but today was the first time the pair met with voters together. It's a close race right now, and one analyst says every little thing, including an endorsement from a senator, can make a difference in an election. I support Thad Gerardo. Um, he's going to be a terrific legislator for our state. With that endorsement, Senator Joe Donnelly and Thad Gerardo campaigned with the lunch crowd at the Dash Inn. He's gone to Congress that has been so partisan, and he's accomplished. And that's what I love about Senator Donnelly. That's why I'm honored that he's here, because he's a mentor. I want to be a legislator just like him. Donnelly says he supports Gerardo for the 81st District state rep seat because he's willing to work across party lines. And it's about what policies make sense. And Thad's not going to hesitate uh, to tell Democratic folks down there they're wrong if they're wrong, or Republican folks that. He's going to fight for Fort Wayne. And so I'm, I feel lucky to be here with him. I know exactly what my district wants me to focus on. And it's not about being a Democrat or a Republican issue. It's about a Hoosier issue. They want legislators down at the state house who get work done. And that's what I plan to focus on. Incumbent Republican Martin Carball won the seat two years ago, beating longtime Representative Democrat Wynn Moses. He's not worried about Donnelly's endorsement of his opponent and says he's already worked across the aisle and will continue to do so. My bills that have passed and have been authored have had Democrat co-authors. I work with Democrats. I've always said we don't have a monopoly on good ideas, uh, but where we can work together, I'm happy to work together with some of my Democrat friends. Political analyst Andy Downs says in a close race, every little thing can matter. Even though this is a conservative area of a conservative state, Donnelly won an election. Uh, he won it pretty well. He, I would imagine, still has pretty decent approval ratings at this time. So I would think this is probably a good thing for the campaign. Downs it says redistricting in 2010 made the 81st district a little more Republican friendly, but this election will help determine just how Republican or Democrat the district really is. In Studio 15, Alyssa Ivinson, News Channel 15.